This is where we start today, our high desert ranch near Sonoida, Arizona. But we're going for a ride today. Let's go see what kind of trouble I can get into, and hopefully back out of. Please enjoy my stories or whatever else might be on my mind today. Stopped along the road out here. Bug boys checking out the bushes. Warm. The difference in the quality of the video here is that the dash cam is looking through a dusty windshield. Ooh, look at the purple flowers. A butterfly. A butterfly? Is it flutter by? Where's the butterfly? Oh, he's on there. Huh. Pretty small. Yep, damaged wings, end of season. But the plants are beautiful. Look at that. Delicate little flowers. And a bunch of them. And then here's the orange ones. Were those? I think it's like end of season. They were might not have been orange when they were actually blooming. Very pretty. Very pretty. There was a nice boy down there picking flowers for his mother. Look at that one little spot in the clouds. Never yeah. seen that before. Neat area here. Look at this. Couple of still shots here to show you just how beautiful the drive is coming back down out of these mountains. Down on Solero Road. Stupid's okay, that's good. Stupid is fun. Don't say anything. It's political, religious, or things like that. Oh, yeah. Ta yeah I, I, taught me everything I know. I guess if I'm going to say something stupid, it's going to be your <laughs> fault. <laughs> You know, You'll get blamed so, for it. Haven't had, a, haven't had an original thought at the age of 46, huh? <laughs> huh? Why? Why rethink things? <laughs> you got it right the first time. Your car might have a little bit of a problem right here. Yeah. Uh, but your car is a lot more capable than you think. Subaru Outback that's lifted, what, two, two and a half inches? With bigger tires? Well, we turned around. And those mountains there are probably in Mexico. We stop here to air up the tires. You can hear the compressor running. We let the air pressure down to about 18 pounds per square inch when we're going off road, but then you gotta pump it back up when you go back on the highway. 
So we're waiting for the tires to get up to about 33 pounds per square inch. We're going for a walk here in a minute. We're, go <laughs> we're going for a walk in a nature preserve down here by Patagonia, Arizona. And we're walking on an old railroad, what's the word? Berm. Berm, a railroad berm. Well, the railroad berm must go that way because we're going downhill now. The train didn't do this, but it went from Benson, Arizona, an old mining town, all the way to Guaymas, Mexico. This is the trail we've been following, but now we hit a meadow place. Oh, deer. I just saw a deer running. Uh, you know what they're doing? They're playing. You know, the buffalo. The buffalo, they roam. Those deer and those antelope, they just play. <laughs> so, what do you think of the stabilization in my new iPhone 13? Hey, <laughs> if your son's not hitting your elbow. Yeah. Supposed to get a picture of me, I'm the star. You were in there. I know. Yeah. How much of you was I supposed to get? <laughs> this is an interesting place for Arizona. Look at the size of that tree over there. That's that dead tree. Look at that. Look at that. Yeah, that's that huge. Whoa. I can't believe how big that tree is. The old railroad trail. Lots of leaf clutter. Sonoida Creek. Lots of fish. Well, we found a path. Are you going? Can you go all the way up that way? Before I before I do that, you hear that sound? Yeah, it's raining. It's starting to rain. Yeah, it's That's starting. Awesome. Yeah. Uh, before I go up there, tell me if you can get all the way. It it goes over the trail. And yeah. And not down again. Okay. So. Actually, it does go all the way. It's a little treacherous, and there's a there's an easy way out over there. How about if you're uh, 30 years older? The chicken path is to your right. I'm coming. <laughs> the chicken path. Oh, you didn't tell me about the sticky stuff. Uh, I don't know about this. I'm starting to wonder if this was a good idea. Me? What? Huh? Are you kidding me? We can do this. We who? We. <laughs> I thought you said this was easy up here. I said the chicken path was to your right. What? I said don't come this way. <laughs> Holy crap, look how far it is to the ground. You got to go back down, right? Yeah. Huh? Oh, wait a minute. The chicken path. No. Holy crap. Look how far I came, though. Uh, wait for me.
Do we have a cell phone signal here? <laughs> it's not as bad as it looks. Yeah. It's not as bad as it looks. It is one-handed if you're a videographer. <laughs> I'll take the video. I'll take the video. You you keep uh, two hands and two feet on something at all times. Okay. Two hands and two feet. Two hands. Two hands Reminds and two feet. School during the Cold War. Put your head under your desk and grab your ass. <laughs> I know you'd rather I took the video the whole time, even if it meant you falling over helping you. I know, I know, I know this YouTube content's really important to you. And just think, that hospital trip could have been really interesting too. Thanks. Let's do this one. 75? Six. 76. Let's just back up here and take a, backed off view of what he just did. We were down there, down there, and he just scaled this entire tree from the ground down there all the way up, over, and back down again. Yeah, well it doesn't look so scary in the video. Until you see your face <laughs> when you watch it back. Do not show this one to me. You're a mother. Okay? <laughs> hey, if you like me, give me one of those thumbs up. And please subscribe and hit that little bell so you know when I post next. Please share me with your friends on social media. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed what was on my mind today.